My name is Richard Shoebridge, and I'm part of Team GB Short Track Speed Skating. I'm Charlotte Gilmartin, also from Team GB Short Track Speed Skating. A typical training session for us starts with about 45 minutes of off-ice warm-up, you know, jogging, stretching, and just getting our legs ready to be in skating position itself. Races in short track consist of four to eight people, depending on the distance. We all race in pack style, so it's very, you know, tight passing, a lot of action, a lot of adrenaline for everybody. You put your toe in to get caught to the line, and then it's ready, and then the gun goes, and then from there on in, it's just bustle and bustle to get into the right position. Well, in short track, cornering is the most important thing that we do. The corners determine how much speed you lose, how much speed you gain, what position you're in, how you're going to set up a pass. So you go in sort of like in the middle of the track, and you try and come out in the middle of the track. That's the most efficient track pattern for us. To be a good speed skater, you need to be able to, one, react quickly, and two, be decisive. You hesitate around the corner, people are going to come past you. Hesitate. When you're behind somebody, you're not going to have enough speed to make a pass. You're always jockeying for position, you're always racing, it's high speed, there's a lot of action going on. If you get a good buzz off of that, you can be a good speed skater. So we've got quite a lot of equipment that you have to wear. The gloves obviously are cut resistant. At the end of the gloves we also have tips just on the left hand, it just stops any friction happening. Our speed skates are actually moulded to your feet when they're made, compared to a normal kind of hockey skate. It is a lot thinner, our blades was like 17 to 18 inches and that will just help with cornering to be able to get in the right position, to put your weight in the right place to be able to glide better. Well, I mean UK sport and lottery funding is so crucial I and mean, I cannot express how important it is for us. Being an elite sport, you need to be training two, three times a day and with the funding it allows us to, you know, to be able to do that freely. For us that's a major difference in our life. You know, our team's been training hard over the last four years, and uh, we've had some good performances. You know, we've had a world record breaking relay team. The girls have done really well with medals and individual medals at the European World Championships. So we've shown the world that we are ready to compete at the highest level. So why not do it now? Thanks for watching. And if you want to follow our road to Sochi, subscribe here.